Something leaping around down there. I suspect a pickerel. Maybe a bass. A snapping turtle seems like a long shot. Uh -oh, there's the jeweled lotus. Anyhow, there's an optical illusion of upstream waves from wind ripples when the water is actually flowing in the opposite direction. <coughs> so this was my little roost beneath some kind of exotic birch. And that is High Street over there, which pretty much gets us to the end of this section. The next plan will be to follow High Street. Well, actually to follow the river a little further because we're right at the first Mystic Lake. Great blue heron over there, <coughs> but then someone on a path on the other side spooked it. <coughs> Wouldn't surprise me if it's laying low somewhere over here. <laughs> it's amazing how they dialed back their wariness. Oh, there's some. Pond lily is fairly close to the shore. River Street undergoes a transformation and becomes Medford's Harvard Ave. And we have some little memorial thing over here. Veterans, no doubt. 
A lot of flags involved. What does it say? Dana Sharpton. Gone but not forgotten. Yes. Would have been a little kid when I was playing here. A little, about a year younger than my brother. Now they haven't actually mowed this strip yet. It's a white lilac, and because of the strange, cool summer we've had, it's still in blossom somehow. How cool is that? This has been a, an odd year for climate change trend bucking. Who knows what it means? Wow, and the, the barrier for the hydrocarbon mess continues. Wow. <laughs> Jeez, I wonder how long it's all going to be there for. Another run of impressive stonework. Slow flow. And this minor squeeze point. There's High Street wending its way West Metford Wood. And the river skirts West Metford and aims for Winchester. Follow it a little more. There's an interesting little parcel ahead. Then I'll eventually meet the 94 bus over in West Medford that way. 